Hi, do you want to create a beautiful map like this? So let's do it together. I start from uh, adding the data. Now, as you can see in my map, I have the polygon maps and my point. So let's go ahead. Uh, first, I work on the polygon and I change the sphere, uh, sim simple field. And I can choose the color. I choose the gray color. Actually, you can choose uh, any color based on your preference, but I like gray color. And for the stroke, as you can see in the boundary, I choose white color. And let's apply. OK. So as you can see, I have a beautiful gray and white background maps. And let's now work on the points data. And the points data represents the, the main cities. So, uh, let's do some visualization for the population of the main city. I go to symbology. I change from I change from single symbols to cat to uh, graduate, and then I choose the field that I want to do the visualization. I choose the population map, and I do I separate the class into five: one, two, three, four, five, and I click OK apply. I just see the view. Okay, so now let's do some uh, customized uh, customizations of the points. I give this value to number three. Uh, the size number four, and this side number five, and this side number six. Let's test. Okay. As you can see, we have the map like this. And as you can see, the, the colors are different. And in my case, I want to have the same color because the size of the points already represents the population. So let's have a uniform color. I double click and click here. I can choose the colors I want. And in this case, I choose the green color because I love green. And this field, field color, I choose green. OK. Ah, I did not choose green for here. Uh, for field color, I choose green. Uh, stroke uh, is still black. And OK. And this thing, uh, I can also change the colors here as well. I choose green. And the, the, the same thing. And also the same thing. And let's apply it and OK and see. So we have a beautiful map here, but like you can see, the boundary is black. Uh, I don't. Maybe I want to remove the stroke or the boundary of my points. Let's do it. So again, click here, stroke line, no pen, no boundary. No pens, it means no boundary or no stroke. No pen, okay. And this one also and clicks pen and clicks okay. So you as you can see, the maps becomes more beautiful. And uh, for the point sign, in this case, I would not recommend you to show in the global levels. I think the size will be shown in the regional level, like in this scale. Yeah, you can move the area. Okay. It can be shown in this, this scale. And see, the map is really beautiful. Let me know if you have any question. I'll try my best to answer you. Thank you.